Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Bilal Abdul Kareem. And I'm just sitting here, I'm chilling in the studio, and I'm just looking through the news. And I see that Adil Jubeir, who used to be the foreign minister for Saudi Arabia, but then he got demoted. I don't really know how it goes. But anyway, he said yesterday, or two days ago, that the Saudi leadership is a red line regarding the uh, Khashoggi case, because people are trying to make trouble for the Saudi government because of their killing of uh, Jamal Khashoggi, the journalist. And he said that that's a red line. Don't touch it, basically, he's saying. He's also going on to say that anybody who uh, uh, decided to infringe upon that, then they will pay the consequences. Well, let's examine this statement for a second. First of all, that being a red line, meaning your leadership. What about murder? Is that like a red line? Oh, wait a minute. That's not a red line because that's what you guys do all the time. And why would that be a problem for Donald Trump? They've been doing the same thing with the Americans. For generations, they've been doing it. The problem that I have is that the Saudis, the Americans, and people like them, they have the legitimacy to be able to say, this one is a terrorist and that one is not. And when people would look at it, they would say, look, the Saudis said that so-and-such is a terrorist. Oh my God. And then they say, what about the Americans? What do they say? They say, ah. Ah, they said the same thing. It must be true. That's what we have in this world here today. We have so many people who have no legitimacy whatsoever with anything. But yet, because they're the head of a powerful nation, they get to say who a terrorist is and who a terrorist isn't. And by the way, Adil Jubeir, if you happen to be watching this, who are you talking to if somebody says something about, uh, um, about the crown prince and they're going to pay the price? Well, I ain't paying no price. How about that? And I said something about him, and you could tell him I said it. I'm Bilal Abdul Kareem. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.